I couldn't deal with it anymore. It wasn't fair. Something had to be done. They deserved endless torture beyond their understanding. If I can't understand, then when their time comes, they shouldn't understand either. I have the tools, but I can't use them. This project is the result of feral fluid machines and a cult made by the same guy inventing the feral fluid machines, lads. This is Oreneo. <laughs> What's good everybody, my name is Cece here and welcome back to Incredibox. So today I am here with Oren Ao, possibly one of the biggest deal videos that I have ever done. So I have not been requested to do a mod more than this one, lads. This one is just, it, it, it's fucked from what I've been told essentially. This one looks like a dick. Oren Ao is said to be one of the scariest, if not the scariest of all Incredibox mods. I even heard one comment say that it makes void and optophobia look like kid shit. And what a better way to prove that point with that one that says I could couldn't think of an icon. <laughs> Just the overall aesthetic of this as well is just absolutely fucking insane. Also over here, I have this game also pulled up. This is pretty much like an encyclopedia of all the characters because this shit is lore heavy as fuck. Makes my balls tingle and gringle with success and enlightenment. Then we will check it out. But for now, lads, let's just get straight into this, boys. Here we go. Okay. Okay. Very simple, very simple. So it, before we keep going, I gotta make a prediction. Is this going to be an actual thing? Like, is this going to be an actual boss ass fucking thing of music or is this just gonna be in like just strict fucking atmosphere? I don't know. That's horrifying. So what happened to these two? Like, especially this guy, he just looks like he just got dicked in his ass. Name none, gender none, age none. Fantastic. Love to learn. The conceptualization of redacted sphere after experiencing trauma when encountering a rotting corpse in a ventilation system of his best friend's home. This is fucked. He thought it was alive and froze in the same place for 26 hours waiting for it to snap to life and kill him. His friend was convicted of and he was given therapy, which then resulted in the document being recorded. Lovely dovely. So this guy's fucked. 17-year-old female. Holy shit. This is fucking creepy as hell. Hart was a victim in an apartment fire caused by Kurt. So why the fuck is she here then? Hart ran out of the building without her arms. Bleeding in her torso was on fire. She passed down the street and almost... But a bystander called 111 before many people... Hart suffered severe vocal damage and trying to speak caused her to spew blood on the floor. After being put back into an optimal state, she was taken to recovery where she currently is right now. Fantastic, boys. This is just- this is so fucked up. I is this still like- Cause I know that this one is like so lore driven and there's gonna be a lot of moments in this where we're gonna stop and read and shit and fucking fucking shit. Chill with me, alright? Let let's just go on this journey together, boys, okay? Cause we're here for the long haul. I'm not just testing out sound effects today, lads. We're getting a story, motherfuckers! Bring it on! Yes, this guy's fun. Gotta love him. Hey, hey, hey. Holy shit. It's a cat girl. What the fuck is this? Just someone puking. <laughs> This was a sculpture donated to a museum. Many people reported hearing muffled screams coming from the statue. After six days of being up in the museum, an investigation was made. It was found out that it was a top half of a person with a hole drilled in their head, lovely dovely, covered in clay. They were somehow alive, but had minutes before the investigation. This is some shit. <laughs> a great friend of- <coughs> However, they were known to be an alcoholic and was once found- Oh boy. Known to be alcoholic and was once found being- by a tiger at the zoo after it had closed. Lovely, this is a wholesome game. Thankfully, someone who was on the night shift has seen this and shot the tiger to death. Oh. Tried to reassemble their corpse to bring them back to life. Great. Okay, 36 year old male. Lovely, dovely. All right, this guy just looks absolutely clouding around, bro. What the fuck is his story? Hold the hell, hold the, hold the hell up. Wait, what the, what, what is this? What is Obi? Lovely. Yeah, this one's fantastic. This sounds like nothing but butterflies and sunshine in my book. Great! Our third prototype. It was a success, but failed in form. We could only simulate her pain and not actually revive her. What the kind of- what kind of fucking shit? My god, man. Alright, this is every beat together. This is 
the saddest fucking scariest thing I've ever seen. This one is gonna give me hypertension. Okay, so, um, okay, overall thoughts so far. Uh, I very much do understand why this was so requested. It's kind of super duper fucked in the ass. <laughs> yeah, if there's a lot of, if there's a lot of just gaps in the audio, that's because I say like a no-no word. Um, you just gotta roll with me on that one. Uh, whoo-wee! Alright, lads, now we go to the effects. So, uh, let's just get a quick little glimpse of this. That looks insane. Okay, great! Oh my god, that's awesome. That's awesome as fuck! I love this guy! That is badass as hell. Listen to homie just speak from the tongue. Ethan, age 19, male. Ethan Tadpole <laughs> was a musician with great talent. Unfortunately, he was at the age of 19 via being shot in the eyes with a pistol and then dropping a tuba onto the victim's face. Wait, wait, hang on, hang on a sec. Wait, whoa, hold up a tick. Unfortunately, he was at the age of 19 via being shot in the eyes with a pistol and then dropping a tuba onto the victim's face. I, I don't know, I, wait, am I reading that wrong or is the grammar there just fucked? Who was, like, isn't he the victim? Or did he get shot and then have a tuba dropped on him? Because the way, it, the way it's written is that he got shot and then dropped a tuba onto a victim. That's what, that's what it's written as. So he just got, he just got bonered in the face. And then just had like a, like a, like a 75 pound tuba just crumble his ass like a cookie. I mean, it sounds sick. Like, th this sounds fire, bro. This is a neat little sound. This is lovely. Look at this little man. Oh, yeah, he's he's fun. What the fuck is your problem? Yeah, this sounds lovely. 18-year-old female, one of the few cultists we were able to find, curing the AIDS that she had. Yeah, she looks like she's doing well. This guy just looks like a whole dandy full surprise of loves and sunshine. What's your story, lad? Give me, give me some juice. Oh, that's terrifying. <laughs> Sounds good. <laughs> Anything else? You just gonna hold your peace? Yeah. Sounds great. That's the most scariest shit I've ever seen in my life. He deserved it. Fuck. Ah. Uh, holy shit. Um, that's the scariest one so far. Um. Oh my god. <laughs> Yo. This is mad. Ah. Uh, I'm just dumbfounded by this one. I didn't expect that. He deserved it. Didn't the description say that everybody in this deserved to be here? Half of these people are just victims. God, this is sad. This this is oh my god. This is one of the scaries that's sad. It's such a different spin to on Incredible Box. Like this is not a this is not a music game. The, 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 that, that whole concept is fucked. This just tells you the most insane story you've ever heard. And damn it, I love it. Yay, this guy looks awesome. <laughs> Why is that the noise? It's like a VHS being inserted. And he also doesn't move either. That makes it so much worse. Why is that the noise that this man makes? That, oh god. Oh god, okay. Lovely, lovely. Let's see what homie has cooking. Our fourth prototype. It had failed as the two subjects we're testing had fused and became too con- Oh my god. We only wish to use Zeta- Zeta? Zeta? We only used to use Zeta's skin and not fuse both Alpha and Zeta. This is this creepy shit! Yo, holy fuck. Oh my god. After reading that, I, I glanced over at the icon and it genuinely like- Oh my god. What the fuck? Oh my god. See, here's the thing. Here's the thing, lads. Fuck the music. I, I don't give a shit. I'm, I am not looking at this from an actual Incredibox reviewer standpoint of like, well, the beats in this one are pretty lackluster. I'm just trying to understand the story that this guy is telling, and so far, it's fucked. <laughs> oh, great. This one's just better. God. This is so fun. This is so fun. Oh my god, this creepy shit! Okay, alright, alright, sorry, sorry. I, I, I love scary shit. I, it, it just, I don't know, it gets me rushed. Lilac, 44, female. Lilac was a famous musician. They were one day at a concert on stage by what the audience described as a mass of wires covered in oil tangled, in, uh, tangled around in a shadowy figure. What the fuck does that mean? 
Is that the blob from FNAF? This did not seem like a person, but rather a machine. However, it was apparently too natural to be artificial. What the hell does that mean? What is that? What the, what, what are you talking about? This is nuts. <laughs> a mass of wires covered in oil tangled around in a shadowy figure. Yo, what are you talking about? Like, this shit has left me speechless. Like, this has left me damn speechless. All right, here is every effect together. Am, am I the only one who's like scared shitless? <laughs> it's not it's not even like the atmosphere that's fucking me. It's just the stories, the backstories, knowing the backstory that no and then seeing them up there and just trying to think of the situation. Like it, it's fucking me. Th this this is it. Like, this is it, lads. Th this is what I've been asking for. This is the analog horror in credit box that I've been wanting. My God, it's amazing. Like, it, it, it's it's so good. It, it, it's so absolutely just incredible. Like, it, it really, really, really is. All right, now we move on to the melodies. Yeah, we're never gonna get a break, are we? <laughs> it's all just gonna be ass. At least he's happy. A man who is currently relatively unknown was found running around a homeless shelter naked as they were extremely high on... After running outside, many people recall him cackling hysterically as he ran. He was then chased by police and beat to death outside of an elderly woman's home. Fuck me, man. D yo. Oh my god. Ugh. I don't know why, but reading that, I just... I don't want to sound like like a bitch. Like, I don't want to sound like a YouTuber right now. That's not what I'm trying not to sound like. Whoa, I'm, am I the only one getting chills? I'm not trying to sound like that, but genuinely, that fucked me up reading that last line. I don't know why. Oh god. Okay, great. You ever seen those TikToks where it's like liminal land? And it's like, This is Miranda before the accident. And this is her after. That's the vibe I'm getting from this and I fucking hate it. <laughs> Alright, little TV man. This is on the whiteboard. This is a literal TV. How the fuck is this a victim? Th that's what all these people are, right? They're victims and shit, right? I don't know. What the hell is this one's story? Best Buy ran out of good flat screen, so we had to compromise. This was an old TV that was tampered with by using ferro fluid and rotting flesh. Great. Um, well, uh, sh that answers the question. How the fuck can you make a TV like this? Yeah, no, it was a test. They just chucked it onto an object. Um, so that ferro fluid shit, right? It did that to a TV. Nuts. Ah, uh, okay. Yep, okay. I'm trying to collect my thoughts and thinkles here because this one is just like... Oh my god, man. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. This is such a big deal mod and I'm not treating it as that and it's now starting to sink in how fucked this really is. So... Man! Huh. Yes, this guy looks... Fuck you! No! Nah! Nah, bitch! Nah! <laughs> no shot! I can't listen to that! No! No, 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 no! I cannot! I, I genuinely can't! I cannot! Oh, fuck! I cannot look at that face and then hear that sound! That is the creepiest- Okay. I'm an adult man. I got this in the bag. Look at this fucking shit. THAT'S THE CREEPIEST SHIT! <laughs> scariest thing I've ever seen. That's awesome. This is metal as fuck. This <laughs> fantastic. Can't wait to hear this asshole story. Wait, Kurt, this is fucking Kurt. Hold up. Wait a second. Hold up. Wait, no, who the fuck was it? Not you, you goofball. This guy. This was a victim of an apartment fire that was caused by Kurt bitch ass. Holy shit. So this person right here was mortaled by this bastard, this creepy fuck. 12 years old! I didn't even read that. Kurt was a 12 year old child who suffered from schizophrenia. He was very introverted and did not speak often, so his hallucinations were never brought up before with his parents. At 5.25 a.m. on the 24th of May, he set a building on fire due to his currently undiscovered schizophrenia. Most people in the building evacuated, but Kurt had trapped himself in the building after many vivid hallucinations. Great. When the building had collapsed, he got stuck in the rubble for two days before being excavated and sent to the hospital where he was wrapped heavily in bandages. He died later that day. Okay, great. And this is the fucking sound that they give him? This is what we gotta work with, lads. Is this, is this how we play him? Great. So this person right here was an accidental victim of this guy's schizophrenia. Yo, I can't. This is insane. <laughs> That's it! I can't. I, I, I seriously cannot look at him 
Kurt. I can't look at Kurt, bro. I can't do it. I, I, I legitimately, I don't know why. This is what I wanted. I asked for this. I asked for this, and everyone yelled at me and told me that this is it, and I didn't believe them. Oh, God. Oh, shit. I got my hands covering my face right now because I am just dumbfounded about what the hell I'm looking at. Okay, great. This is much worse than I thought it would be. Ooh. Yo, what? That is insanely different. What are you? What the hell is this? Wait, why is this guy so different? The last one was too crazy. Now we got this guy to kind of balance shit out. Kratzper. Kratzper was our first attempt at mimicking the technology used by the cult to restore people to optimal states. Yay. He had an extreme injury causing a near-death experience. Many of his senses were damaged, but the mimic was very effective. Oh, awesome. Great. Love to see it. All right, the final boy, final boy, final boy. What we got? Hmm. Sounds fantastic. Yes. I enjoy this. You know, it's, lads, uh, today we're making some... Shut the hell up! We're making some bumping thumpers today, lads. Like, I, I just gotta be honest. It doesn't even have a photo. It doesn't even have a photo. What the hell? Why is there no photo? How much is known about Tab? Uh, all we know is that he works in an office building and has a strange body pigment disorder. Why was I told to write this document? God, this is crazy. This is fucking wild. This is living. Oh, God, these next people look fuck. All right, you guys ready for some Danithal shit? Yeah, this guy looks. Can't wait to hear this jackass's story. That is the creepiest thing I've ever heard in my life. Can't wait. Oh, it's burned. Lovely. How fun is that? James, 27-year-old male. James had no care for his own life and was extremely aggressive towards all people he had known in his life. This resulted in what he called his final act. He had put his neck in a vice and, yeah, uh, simply to spite his loving father. What? Later, he had awoke in the ceiling of an apartment building where he was tor- Yo, where he was going by many people. And it's just gone. You just can't see the rest. What the hell is wrong with James, man? Uh, I, I, I'm sorry if I'm not, like, commentating the world's best here, bro, but I'm just... I'm just floored by this, like... Yeah, James got problems, man. And this guy's no better. What the hell is this? What is this? What is this nonsense? Oh. Uh. <laughs> Lois. I'm coming. Yeah, this guy's awesome. Yeah, I don't know what the hell's wrong with James, bro, but no, 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 no. 56-year-old male unknown. Yay! Dave's corpse was found in a newly resurrected apartment building with two nails in his eyes and a car jack beside him covered in blood. Fantastic. He was still alive by the time that he was found, but he had starved before any medical attention could be brought to him. Shut up. Dave's uniform was brought beside him when he died, and this uniform led to an office building. However, the owner of the business said that Dave had years ago, even though forensics showed that the corpse was only present in that location for three days. Ah. Uh, this is... This is just awful. <laughs> I still don't know what James' problem is. Like, yo, why is why is his backstory, like, one of the worst? Now we got Dr. Skipper. <laughs> Fuck that! Yep. Okay, that's great. Yep. It's fantastic when it changes. You know, for each loop, it's different. You know? That's very assuring. Yeah, that's awesome. Alright, so the demon duck from hell, what do we got? Our final experiment, it was a 100% success as the duck had become immortal after using the ferro fluid and could easily be to- Hold up. What? Wait, yo, 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 wait, yo, rewind, back up, take your shoes off, sit the fuck down, talk to me. What are you talking about? It was a hundred percent success. The duck had become immortal after using the ferrofluid and could easily... So the point of it is to make them immortal with the intention of fucking with them. That's what I'm getting from this. Is that is that is that the story, lads? The cult. Okay, I'm I'm trying I'm trying to Jimmy Neutron bl brain blast this shit. The cult is trying to keep people alive forever, so that they can endlessly for them. 
That's what I'm getting from this. I don't know if that's right, but that's what I'm starting to get. This duck one is crazy. Because this, this, this one right here, this one right here literally spelled it out for you. So, could easily yell. This is mad. So what's the story here? They just take victims of accidents and then just... Go nuts! Like, that, that's just what- that's just what they do? There's only two left. There's only two left, and, uh, yeah, it's gonna be great. I forgot, did we actually do all the melodies together? I don't think we did. My bad. <laughs> Weren't missing out on much. Great, this one looks awful. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, but okay. Yeah, this one's, uh... Good God. Okay, this one is, uh... Fantastic. Gotta love it. Koski was a YouTuber who explored the genre of 3AM horror with a twist. Obviously, there wasn't such thing as an oo-woo cult. <laughs> what? So she hired actors. Her depiction of a cult was very offensive, and we had her... Yo, this is crazy. To repay the... To repay the mockery. What the hell? She was revived, however, and sent back into society, where she later deleted her channel and went to therapy for 17 years. Yo, this is mad! Yeah, so she pretty much- this cult thing, she pretty much just mocked it and got bonered for it. Lovely. That's a lovely thing. That's fantastic. Gotta love that one. Yep, that one's my favorite. Okay, great. Alright, lads, we got one more left. I am drained <laughs> from this. What we got, lads? Great. Another horrifying looking guy. That's the scariest... Just the not moving face, man. Ah! Andrew, 57. Andrew was reported missing for 26 hours until he was found at the bottom of a lake. Great! Not much else is known about Andrew. Fantastic. Lovely. They just found him and then made him that. Now that we got the full story, Let's see if we can actually make something with this, right? Let's actually see if we could do what the mod, you know, is meant to be uh, a music game, <laughs> I guess. So, let's see what we got, lads. Okay. Ooh, 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 okay. Mm, mm, mm. Who was the backwards talking girl? I kind of want her. Yep, she she's there. She kind of kills it. Hey, 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 what? Ooh, 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 ooh. Hey, what? Bring it on, lads. <laughs> My god, man, this is some crazy shit. This is some shit! It still kind of hits, though, you know. Like, you, you, can, you can still make something genuinely with this. Who knew that these souls would make for a pretty thumping bumper? Hey, 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 what's good, baby girls? Let me hear you shout! That's heavy. Oh, that's juice. That brings the juice. That analog horror juice is being great to me. Hey, 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 hey. This is great. My God, man, this is nuts. The fact that you could still even then make an actual beat with this is crazy as is. Honestly, shout out to that man. Like, on yo, honestly, respect. So I'm ending off right there. So this has been Incredibox or an AO. My God, man, this is one of the best mods I think I've ever played. Simply just because of the insane backstory that went into this. Like, you can tell that there was a lot of passion and love behind this project. Besides this, that you know, I'll, I'll give it a pass. Kind of takes you out of the mood a little bit, but that's fine. I've never had an Incredibox mod that genuinely made me feel something like, like as of this, like, because it's really like got. got your boy thinking and thinking and thunking with the thinkables and thoughts. This is definitely one of the best mods that I have ever played just because of how like not, a, not only just different it was but just what it is and accomplishes is just insane. So sorry for taking so long to get to it but Man, oh man, dude, this was an absolute blast. So I'm my boy Soul, I'm gonna end it off right there. So if you enjoy this kind of content, then the buttons are down there. You know what to do, and uh, have a good one, so goodbye, see ya!